She cheese she A treasured Korean heirloom whose name means seven branched sword. God talk slower. It is said that this sacred sword repre represents life itself. Though the branches may appear to be infinite, the choice is limitless. Like our destinies, the sword comes to but one end, one merciless point. And when the silver cord, the fragile thread that binds us to this world, is severed, is revealed and the implicability of our fate is finally laid bare. Don't know if I word it, pronounce that word correctly. I don't think it's incomplicability. It's probably incomplicability, but I don't know. I've never even heard that word before. Anyway, February 6th, 9.48 a.m. Night and Company Law Offices. Hey, Nick. Yeah? What is it? You know how I've got spiritual powers unlike you? Um, uh, sure. You are a spirit medium after all. But just like you, if I don't keep my powers sharp, they'll get dull, right? Um, I guess so, yeah. Glad you agree. Okay, Pearly, you're up. Pearls? So, that's why we need to go on a special spiritual hotspot tour, Nick. Or Mr. Nick. Huh? I I'm lost. What is this your magazine you're shoving in my face? It's the New Year's issue of, oh, cold. Winter special, uh, we're, uh, special. Oh, Pearls looks so happy. Maximize your spiritual powers with just one night of intensive training. Oh, it sounds too good to be true. I'll say. It sounds more like a scam to me. It's at a spiritual retreat called a Kazakura Temple. It's way up in the mountains, and I bet it's nice and cold. Just perfect for training. Now I definitely don't want to go. You know, I think I've heard of this temple before. It's a famous channeling dojo. It's hard for even real spirit mediums for us to make reservations up there. Reservations? For a temple? Are you serious? Don't worry. I've already made special reservations just for us. Yeah. And I signed up for the special course. Th that's nice. And the timing couldn't be better. Since we don't have a case right now anyway. Alrighty then. It's settled. Well, come on. Don't just stand there. Start packing your stuff. Yes, Mr. Nick, you'd better start packing your stuff. Huh? Me? Why do I have to go? Well, we have to be accompanied by someone over 20 years old. Hey, I don't have anything to do with spirit power. The only thing I can channel is a TV. <laughs> it's kind of, it's actually somewhat funny. So, um, is there a heated pool at this Hazakura temple? No, but you can stand under a freezing waterfall. Sorry, but I think I'll pass. I hate cold places. What? No way! How can you be so selfish? Come on, Mr. Nick. Look at this place. Doesn't it look beautiful? Nope. Not going. I'm going to be nice and toasty at home. What the... What is it, Mr. Nick? Let me see that magazine. Th this nun... Is she a friend of yours or something, Nick? The, this girl. It, it's... <sighs> My name is Dahlia Hawthorne. I just want to say, it's an honor for me to be here in your noble presence. <sighs> Honestly, how can any woman ever count on you for anything? You disgust me. But... It, it, it can't be! She was found guilty and should still be in prison. Mr. Nick? I'll go. Huh? Hazakura Temple. I said I'll go. Yay! Isn't that great, Pearly? Yes! Oh, thank you! Thank you, Mr. Nick! 
You'd do anything for Mystic Maya, right? Even walk over burning coals, right? Oh, cold! The New Year's axe you have to receive from pearls. Dahlia Hawthorne. I knew there was no way she could possibly be at that temple, but I just had to see for myself who this nun really was. Huh, cool! Sorry. <laughs> Friday, seven, or February, jeez, we took a whole day to get here? I thought they were packing their stuff the same day. Anyway. February 7th, 3.24pm, Hazakura Temple, main gate. Burr, it, it, it's so c cold here, Nick. Maybe you should put on something warmer for a change. Well, it's supposed to be c c cold. It's t t t training. Uh, achoo! Her teeth are chattering so loudly, it's all I can do to make out what she's saying. Wow, Mystic Maya, so this is the famous Azakura Temple. P -p 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 Pearly, I, 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 achoo! Well, well, well. Oh, uh, let's see, how do I voice her? I don't know. How nice to see you here. Welcome to our temple. I really don't know how I can do her. I don't, I don't really have a, a voice for her. I don't know, maybe it'll work itself out. Who knows? Well, welcome to our temple. Oh, th th thank you. Uh, achoo! Oh, my, my, my. Thank you for coming all this way. Come now, come now. You must you must have been cold. What's with this? What's with the past tense? We're freezing into human... Ho, ho, ho! Well, we are high up in the mountains, after all. In any case, we shouldn't speak here. Please, follow me inside. All right. Th th thank you. I was starting to think I would pass... Oh, yes, yes. I almost forgot to introduce myself. I'm the head nun here at this temple. My name is Bikini. Bikini? That's right. Actually, that's my temple name. What do you think? It's a tradition to have one, and I want something that has a nice image to it. Uh, it doesn't have a nice image to it, just so you know. So, uh, yeah. Anyway. So I thought, why not choose a bikini? Besides, it makes me seem younger. Wahahaha, ho ho ho. It certainly does. Oh, I signed up for your special course. Well, my, my, my. Quite brave of you, considering how cold it is. Young people can be so reckless when they're with their health. Don't blame me if you become one with those two channel. Wah ha ho ho ho. Reckless? Wah ha ha? What are you, Waluigi? <laughs> anyway. Maybe you should maybe you should take it easy tonight, Mystic Maya. We can come back another day. But you went through all that trouble to get reservations for me. Yes, 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 that's right. You come all this way, so please enjoy yourselves. There's still time before supper, so why don't you have a look around? All right, sure. Um, can we move or main hall suspension bridge? I like the music here; it's really pretty. Uh, let's talk. Channeling dojo. Um, so what's a channeling dojo anyway? Oh my my my! You don't even know that. Forgive him, sister, for he knows not what he's saying. Well, well, <laughs> wow, really? Well, 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 just call me Bikini and forget that sister part. A channeling dojo is basically a spiritual power training do spiritual power training ground. We have special holy items pre prepared here to help people boost their spiritual power. Like, we let each other play with Castlevania games and they get used to the freaking, um, crucifix boomerang. I don't know. I'm trying to come up with, like, a Castlevania joke, but I'm not getting one. Anyway. Uh, holy items? If you train an entire evening surrounded by these items, ah, it's quite mysterious. The spiritual power of these items seems to envelop you. Wahahaha. <laughs> wow, she must have just gotten off the trolley from the land of make-believe. Um, so what exactly is the spirit special course? Okay, Jesus. I, w I really wish she would stop interrupting Maya, that way I'd have time to read her dialogue well. Anyway, you must be incredibly devoted to be interested in that at such a young age. It's a training session where you sit on a block of spirit ice and chant a spell for 30,000 times, all the while being showered in freezing cold spirit water. Eh? It's February now, right? You have to be careful this time of year. If you don't watch it, you'll catch pneumonia or even die of hypothermia. So be careful, you hear? Wahaha, ho ho ho, ha. How am I supposed to be careful? Oh no, I knew I shouldn't have signed Mystic Maya up for this. Okay, the other nun. Um, sister, about this picture. Well, well, look at that. I must say I look rather divine here, don't you? No. 
Oh, um, yeah. Unforgettable in every way. You mean it? Oh, I knew it. Wahaha, ho ho ho. Jeez, shut up. The makeup was pretty tough, but Iris helped me out. Iris? The cute little girl in the photo. She looks just like me, doesn't she? No, she doesn't. She looks way better than you. We're just a small temple here, so she and I run the entire place. Really? That kind of sounds like fun. Sorry to cut in, but... This Iris. Where is she right now? Oh, just listen to you. You haven't come all the way up here just to find a girlfriend, have you? Glare. No, no, no. Th that's not what I had in mind at all. Anyway, Iris is in the Inner Temple preparing for this evening. Inner Temple? Yes, yes, yes. All right, yes, yes, that's right. Iris will be back this evening. Why don't you go have a look at the main hall for now? Waha, waha, ha, ha, ha. So she's in the Inner Temple, huh? All right. Um. Well, I guess we'll go ahead and move around. Let's, uh, how about we look at the uh, suspension bridge first? Screw you, main hall. Oh, really? <laughs> February 7th, suspension bridge. Wow, look at this broken down old bridge, Nick. Y yeah, and look at that big canyon below us. Hey, hey, there's a river down there. It looks like it's flowing real fast. What's wrong, Nick? You look like you've seen a ghost. I I'm just not very good with heights. Oh, hey, I've got it. Maybe you should face your fear and try hurling yourself off the edge. You know, one, two, three, jump. It might be just what you need to get over your fear of heights. Yeah, death is a real good way to overcome phobias, all right. Anyway, it sure does look like a rickety bridge. Can't argue there. That's probably why it's called Dusty Bridge. Read it again, Maya. It says Dusky Bridge. Well, it's practically the same thing. <laughs> okay, so I guess he's not going to... Oh, well, he, didn't... he was never involved in that. Dusky Bridge. Some letters are engraved into a roughly cut boulder. D D U S T Y bridge, huh? It says dusky, dusky bridge. Okay. Come on, Nick. Take a look at that bridge and tell me it's not supposed to be dusty. The sign's obviously wrong, and I'm not gonna. F and I'm gonna fix it. Now, give me a pencil, Nick. Do I look like a pencil holder to you? Yes. Even though I'm invisible, technically. Uh, okay. Let's go back to the main gate. Get out of my way. You're too fat. I can't even get past you. All right. Main hall. Oh, jeez, that's a freaking huge Makatama. Wow. All right. The, the, the main hall. I th think it's even c c c colder in here. Uh, chew. Ah, Mr. Nick, do you smell that? It smells like meat and gravy. Yeah, you're right. I guess it's pot roast for tonight. Yum. Weird. I thought they'd serve something a little more, well, traditional. What are you talking about, Nick? You think monks and nuns just sit around eating rice and rice gruel all the time? Mystic Maya is right. Ooh, I hope there's mashed potatoes, too. I love mashed potatoes. Ha ha ha. What a cute little acolyte. Let's see. I do not know how I'm going to do you. Greetings to all of you. Oh, um, hello. Wow, this lady makes Maya look e look. Wait. <laughs> okay, wow. This lady makes Maya look like a 6.8 of, of 10 on the weirdness scale. Your outfit... Did you come here for the special course, too? <laughs> Unfortunately, no. Actually, I'm... Ah! Y you're... Y you're... You're Miss Elise Donum! Yes, that's right. You know of me? M my name... My name is Pearl Fay. I... I'm your biggest fan. Who is she, Nick? Hmm... I see it now. Zvari! A fortune teller? <laughs> uh, I've got all your books, Miss Donum. <laughs> what a sweet thing to say. And please call me Elise. Um, books? Mr. Nick, don't you know anything? Don't you even know who this is? Well, um... An author, maybe? Yes, and an, and an illustrator of picture books. Picture books, huh? Oh, now I get it. Yeah, I get it too now. But now that we've got it, we're going to end it off. And in the next part, we will continue getting stuff. I don't know. Whatever. Anyway, see you then.